Hi, I'm Jeff Stokes. Welcome to Jeff's Daily Dose of Encouragement. Today I want to encourage you about death and resurrection. In uh, Romans chapter 6 and verse 4 it says, Therefore we are buried with him by baptism, that's with him Jesus Christ, by baptism into death, that like as Christ was raised up from the dead by the glory of God the Father, even so we also should walk in newness of life. Now we know that <clears throat> when we get baptized in water, we go down into the waters of baptism, buried with Christ, and then raised up again with him, symbolically showing that we are uh, new people, that old things are passed away, but behold, all things have become new. But in our lives that we live, we experience times of death and burial and resurrection. We, God is constantly dealing with us and it's a process. So sometimes uh, we, we have to let things die because they're not working out or whatever. So we have to let them go, let them go to God and let them die. And then God, uh, further down the track somewhere, breathes life into them again or breathes life into us again and we're able to go forward again and do do things but he's using this process this death and resurrection crucifixion and resurrection if you like in our lives uh, as a constant <clears throat> cycle if you like to bring us to the places that he wants us to often the crucifixion is dealing with things in our lives that um, are not pleasing to him that that are fleshy that need to go sometimes he wants to bring us into something new and better and so he will end a season in our life and then start a new one and so that is my en encouragement for you today if you feel like you're going through uh, that type of thing sometimes we call it a wilderness experience whereby everything is just barren and bare and nothing's happening and we're crying out to God and nothing's happening it's difficult it's hard it's painful um, you know it's it feels hopeless but in that time God is forging in us uh, new things and eventually he will bring resurrection life he'll breathe that life into us and we'll rise and go again so, so that is my encouragement for you today about death or crucifixion and resurrection and how it operates in our lives if you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart God raised him from the dead you will be saved that's Romans 10 verse 9 for whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God God dwells in him and he in God that's 1 John 4 15 God bless you have a great day